the Macedonians. Conceded a fair number of goals from this kind of area recently, and there's another one. Decent delivery in. The breakthrough. There it is, they've been so good from open play. And within a game when you're playing such stellar opposition, the set piece is something you can almost plan to the nth degree, but Blotty, look at that, that kind of space inside the six-yard box. How many questions ask us, was there a block back in the frame soon? He said the door is never shut to anybody. Nestorovsky seizing upon the defensive mistake and scoring! The Macedonians are back on level terms, it's no more than they deserve. Superbly taken goal by Ilya Nestorovsky. It's cost Italy, it's a loose ball by Verratti. Pounced up by Nestorovsky, still got a hell of a lot of work to do. It's the Italian pin to move, they're coming in to try and block the shot. What he does so well when he gets to the edge of the 18-yard box, the composure doesn't look to blast it, take the back of the net off. Just rolls it down to Gigi Buffon's left-hand side. Wonderfully taken, got to roll it in the bottom corner. Now Bernadeschi has found himself caught in possession, and again it's three against three. Pandev's made the run forward here. Gordon Pandev trying to open it up, Nestorovsky couldn't turn. 2-1! Hassani! And it's two in two minutes! And the Macedonians have turned it around, and is there going to be a major shock on the cards here? Not the fact that they closed down Italy. Moon lost momentum when Pandev came inside. Again, Nestorovsky at the hub of it all. And Zani, this is all he can do. He's got to take it early. He's got to get a clean strike on the ball. Not quite as in the corner as Nestorovsky's. And perhaps you're asking questions of Gigi Buffon. Can he get down quicker? Can he get a block to this? And then holding Italy, you think that Italy to finish top of the group might have to win this and every subsequent game. Immobile claiming that he was fouled, nothing given, play goes on, back for Immobile, 2-2, just got his left foot to it, to flick it into the corner, and the Italians are back on level terms to set up a grandstand finale. Shikov's telling him to get up, to get off, doesn't go out and affect the actual ball into the box from Kandreva. This is non-committal defending where you see a defender with his arms behind his back. Got to get closer, got to get close to try and cut the ball off. Sansone again looking for that diagonal over the top. It's Candreva. Tees back in by him for Immobile. And in the second minute of stoppage time, Italy have surely won it. Shiro Immobile. They've got the job done, but what a let off for the Azuri. 2 1 down with 15 minutes to go. The two Giro Immobile goals have surely seen Italy through now. I think the fact that we've seen so long swaths of this game, it was very much backs to the wall. Immobile is very definitely onside, it's a late run. Just behind the back of Moisov. And when it really tells, when it's really been needed, that extra quality, that extra...